Well, hello everyone. Thank you for stopping by. This is Heist Simulator. We're gonna be doing a let's look at of Heist Simulator. What is Heist Simulator? Brief description is lights, camera, heist, grab your perfect team and hack, unlock, disguise, and solve your way to stealing England's finest tat and treasures. Plan your way around lasers, guards, and block doors in some famous locations. Then build your own to share with the world. And I really like that. I really like the fact that you can build your own. So here, uh, this game is developed by Rogue Code and then also developed by Sky Bagel and published by No More Robots. If you guys like this uh, gameplay and you want to add it to your uh, Steam wishlist, you can go ahead and do so right now. Uh, there is no release date, but you can go ahead and play the demo right now for the next Fest Demo Fest event that's going on at the moment. Other than that, let's go ahead and start off with by clicking on a heist by this paper clip here that's telling us what to do. Uh, yeah, so let's, let's do this. Heist. If you're new to the channel, welcome, it's a pleasure and honor. If you're returning subscribers, welcome, it's a pleasure and honor. If you would like to see more of this when this game is out, uh, make sure to hit that like button and let me know down in the comment section below. So this is high school. Click on the high school level and let's see what we can do. Okay. Created by High Simulator, all right, obviously. July 15th of 2021, version 12 description. Welcome to the High Simulator. These levels will guide you through the basics. Download. Excellent. Click the play button to get the to get wait what to get to the campaign. All right, fair enough. This is your planning screen. All right, share Sherlock's home. Sherlock's home. Sherlock's home. <laughs> this is Sherlock's home. Here you can see all the jobs you can pick up. All right, completing jobs will unlock more and will also unlock the ability to modify them for your own campaigns. Now that it's that's it for me, pick a job and get heisting, and I'll see you later. I guess we go to the Sherlock, right? <laughs> uh, embark on your journey into the glamorous world of petty theft. Elementary, my dear heister. Okay. Um, upvote. Like the campaign? Show me some love. All right, well, hang on a sec. Let's do crew, I guess. All right, so here's the crew, or a crew. I guess we can, you know, start our, or pick our crew, right? Do we pick our crew? Do, is it already picked out for us? Uh, this is Keith Smithson, born in 1998 in Essex County. Keith enjoys long walks on the beach, simple lifestyle, and expensive whiskey. Forced entry executive. Is this our only man? You know what, Keith? Send it, I guess. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. Did you know the most requested funeral song? I wanted to read the rest of that. I did. I did want to read the rest of that. I, I, I did not get to see what the most requested song for a funeral is in England. All right. Like, we only have one guy to do this heist, and he's like, forces his way in, it seems like. Welcome to Britain, you bloody yank. Oh, dude. Welcome to Britain, you bloody yank. I don't know my English accent is that good. British accent, sorry. Uh, let's see if there is something touristy you can do while you're here. Try walk over to the paper on the floor. We might find something to do in this place. Okay. Oh, look at this. This game looks cool. I love how this is like laid out here. Nice work. Such an elementary task, don't you think? Make a joke like that again and you're on your own. <laughs> Try using it on the paper and see what happens. You can use left mouse wheel up to get a closer look, okay? So we can get like really up in this. Wow, what is going on down there? <laughs> Pick this up. All right, looks like this is some sort of historical place. I thought it looked quite homely. Sherlock Holmes? Yep, that's it, I'm out. You're a figment of my imagination, you idiot. Just like figment the, the, the dragon. No, tell me what to do next. Paperclip wench. Of course, I get stuck being an imaginary friend of a guy who has a thing for paper clips. Well, this place sounds fun. Let's go have a look inside. You can't see what's inside the room until you've entered them. See if your tiny brain can work out how to get inside using the left button. You can rotate the camera by using Q and E. All right, very well, very well. I like the music. Go inside. All right, we see everything in here. Very good. So what, is this like what we think that's in there? And then that's what's actually in there? Oh no. That is what's actually in there. We just can't see the physical items until we're in there. Okay. Oh, keep out. That's a restricted area. I'm sorry. Let's go into the bathroom, I guess. 
How can we see these though? I don't understand. <laughs> I don't get that. Um, all right. Let's come back out, I guess. We want to go inside and then leave through the front door. Through the cafe. Maybe we go inside here. Open this door. I like the art style in this game. It looks pretty good. Ah, oh, let's have a look at what's upstairs. Oh my god, I feel a sneeze. <laughs> god damn it! All right, I felt a sneeze coming, but I couldn't get it out of my mouth there. Uh, what do you want us to do? I am so sorry, my man. I just blocked it all out of there for a sec. Okay, so we're on the upper. Okay, so go upstairs, leave through the front door. I guess we're just kind of looking in, seeing like everything. Can we go through here? Or is that locked? Open door. Okay. Go in here. Welcome to the Sherlock home. <laughs> Sherlock's home. Please don't touch anything. Also, kindly reminder or refrain. Sorry, kindly refrain from making any noise. My food is microwaving and I need to hear it when it's ready. Ah, an American is quite not a known word. <laughs> Wait, is quiet not a known word there or are you just simple? Rude, we'll have to teach this old bag a lesson. That book looks like it would be a good souvenir. That book right there. You can hover over the people to see where they can see, okay? My guess is, well, we'll need a distraction. It looks like she is looking right at it. Let's have another look downstairs and see what we can find. You can change which story is visible by page up and page down. All right, all right. So look for a distraction, okay? Uh, so this is where she's looking. Fantastic. So page up, page down. Like, obviously, they want us to do something when it comes to down here maybe of a distraction oh wait microwave no there's a microwave upstairs or downstairs it might be downstairs so we can get maybe the microwave up and running here uh oh hmm i wonder where this door leads to it's probably locked but you know you are a locksmith we are okay if you're spotted breaking in you'll fail the level so make sure you are quiet it looks clear in here though so you're good to go okay great Go ahead and unlock the door. Maybe there's something in there. To oh, yeah, the kitchen, because the microwave, duh. See, that's what I'm telling you. I'm telling you, it's going to distract her. Look at this man. Look at him go. Take your time. You're all right. Take your time. All right, go inside. So in here, microwave, turn off. Probably not what I wanted to do. Oh, quite excellent. It sounds like my beans are ready. It sounds like she is on her way down. Let's get back to the book before she is done eating. Okay. Get out of the restricted area though. Like first things first. And then come through here. Fast, fast, fast. Come up here. Yep, she's already in here. Jesus Christ. Okay, go in here. This is fast. Grab the book, grab the book, grab the book. Hopefully you're coming up here, dude. Come on, dude. Bring it, double time. Come on, my locksmith man. Just use right to open up all the actions and do that. All right, we'll do that. Okay, right here, right here, right here. Grab it. Take the book. Great job. Great, now let's get out of here before someone else sees it's missing. We should just be able to walk out the front door. Should? Should? There we go. All right, successful heist, I guess. Not too shabby. All right, well, you know, is what it is. Uh, let's go back to base. I mean, that, that, was, that was simple. Simple enough, I guess. Really didn't give us a lot to talk about, but... Oh, my God. Okay. So that was Sherlock's home. We can go ahead and create a level, which is kind of cool. Or we can go to the ye old Fighting Cocks. A little birdie told me that boss man doesn't trust banks and keeps all of his money inside the pub. It's nice and quiet after closing time. I just need to find a way in. Send me. Send me, dude. All right, so this time we have two people. We have Keith uh, Smithson, who's force, you know, force entry executive, which is basically a lockpick, I assume, right now. And we have Kate uh, Pillay. Kate Pillay was born in 2002. Jesus Christ, that makes me feel old. Birmingham. Kate likes computers. Computers hate her. She has extensive experience when it comes to turning things on and off. She once got angry at a computer and threw it in the ocean. Someone wrote a song about it. It's called A Del Wrong, A Del Rolling in the Deep. Special ability, Neo Level Hacking. 
So she's a hacker. All right. That's good. So we have a hacker and a lock picker. Both people. How are we going to control the two? I'm not really sure. We're going to find that out together, I guess. Yo, rolling up and staying out the yield fighting cocks. Love it. This man wasn't even in the car the whole time. All right, here we go. I see you're trying to rob a pub. Would you like some help? Fine, but only because I want to see if you know what you're talking about. Yeah, right. The first step to a successful heist is proper surveillance. Get to know your surroundings and chat to the locals. Like this gentleman right here. Looks like a homeless person. Oh, also, this is Kate. She knows her way around a computer very well. We're going to need her a little later. Okay, fair enough. So let's go talk to this gentleman. Uh, talk or move here? No, talk. What the hell are you doing? Go back to him? What on earth do you want? Or do you... Do you want, you no good punk? Blimey, I just wanted to talk. Why are you so angry? I'm angry because this damn bouncer. Where is he? Oh, there's a bouncer. With blue hair. Won't let me inside for a single pint. I need to get rid of him somehow. I have the leftover mushroom from my, uh, sandwich. If I could get, if I could get someone, or somehow, to get him to eat it, I'd put him out for the long, or put him out long enough. See, shady folks around here always know best. Let's see if we can get our fun-sized friend to try our fungus. Maybe we could use that hot dog cart over there. There has been something to say, or something tasting in there, that we can load it up on. Dude, the special sauce is coming in. Thanks, imaginary paperclip friend. All right, so, my man, is he gonna give me, yeah, he gave me the mushrooms, fantastic. Let's go over to the hot dog stand. Let's give him a wiener. Is this a one story or two story? Let's see. Oh my God, it's two stories. Three stories, nope, just, just one or two. Okay, so let's use this. So pick up, inspect, pick up the hot dog. So now we have the hot dog, nice. Let's take this over to our little door buddy. Okay, do we have to mix the two or is it already mixed? All right, it seems like it's already mixed. Let's go ahead and give him the hot dog. Hello, my good man. You poisoned the guard, 75p. Hey there, you must be so hungry. So do you fancy this hot dog? A hot dog? I didn't know people ate hot dogs over there, I'll be honest with you. Uh, they are my favorite, how did you know? Ah, just a lucky guess, I guess. What the hell just happened to the camera? And he falls over. <laughs> good job. He's out, but not for long. Okay, that's not good. Uh, next part is tricky, and you'll need to work together. We need to go through this VIP door. You can open it from behind the bar with a button, but that will only open it in for a few seconds. So tell one of your accomplices to press the button, and with your other accomplice, select the VIP room and pray, press wait until open. This will tell them to wait until the door is open, then continue on their plan. Next level, or next, tell them to press the unlock button on the other side, which will make the door stay open. To do all this, I've switched you to planning mode. In planning mode, everything is paused so you can take the time to plan your moves. When you're ready, hit play at the bottom right to execute your plan. You can alternate between planning mode and executive mode as much as you like. This is really cool. I like this. Uh, let's not execute yet. So we have our man here, right? So our man is going to need to press the button. Open VIP. Like, I don't even know who's in there, right? Is there even a guy in there? I don't even know. And then this lady. Sorry. No, I don't want you to freaking go over there. Cancel that. How do I cancel that? No. No, no, no. Go back. Oh, damn it. Um. <sighs> Keith. Delete. No. Just stop it. Stop it. Keith. Delete. Okay, there we go. All right, great. So he's going to go over there and push the button. Kate is going to come and stand right there. And then once she's in, she's then going to press. No, no, no. Then she's going to walk in. You know what? Maybe that's fine. Hit the plan, I guess now. I don't know. 
My man, you better wait for her to get there. You better wait for her to get there. I swear to God. Okay, get in. Good job, Kate. Okay, unlock the door. Keith, come on. Come on in, buddy. We're through. Now we need to get upstairs. Tell Kate to hack the computer, which will open the security gate. Tell Keith to wait until the gate is open. Then use gate or Kate to grab the cash. Make sure to have a look around before leaving. While there is one man objective, while this is, there is one main objective, usually there is also a number two. Okay. Why is it in the owner in here? That's what I'm getting a little confused about. Okay, I guess we go up. Page up. Okay, we'll go here, and then Keith will go here. And then, yeah, there isn't anybody in here, right? No, there's nobody in here. Okay, security. Uh, Kate will jump onto the computer, which I assume is in here, right? Should be in here. Right there, yeah. Hack the gate. Keith will then come over here. Yo, is this a window? Inspect? It looks like a family portrait. Oh, it looks like a safe, dude. Oh, dude, we have time. Oh my god, we have time. Oh my lord, we actually have time. I did not realize we had time. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. I should have known. I should have known. The game should have been a little bit more, like, clear on time. Oh my god. Grab the money. Grab the money. Go. Go. Get the hell out of here. One second. Zero seconds. Busted. Okay. Fair enough. Fair enough. Fair enough. Um, try again, right? Try again. So, Keith, you're gonna hit the button. We gotta do this fast, then. You will come here. What the hell? No. What, what, what just happened? You will come here. Okay. Okay. Send it. Go. Okay, we have a minute and 43 seconds to do this heist, ladies and gentlemen. Quickly, quickly. Can you run faster, lady? No? Like, let's go. Put it on. Okay, go inside. Go upstairs. Keith, get up in here. Fast. Hurry. Let's go. Okay, page up. Uh, Kate, walk in here quickly. Jump on the computer. Hack it. Let's get that going on immediately. Keith, uh, get in front of... Get, Keith, get up here. Keith, get up here and get in front of the security uh, gate here. Yes, yes, yes. Wait for her to get done hacking. She will get that done hacking. Oh, baby. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. There we go. We have one minute. Okay, go grab this. Remove the painting. Uh, Kate, in the meantime, honestly, bounce. You could probably bounce if you wanted to. Uh, Keith, start cracking. Like, Kate could be, like, roaming around grabbing stuff as well. Probably. But, like, I'm too nervous and too scared. Like, that bag of money right there should... Kate probably should have grabbed. Gosh, God. Good God. Hurry up, hurry up, hurry up. Hey, pick it up, pick it up. There is actually a man in the freaking to uh, toilet there. You got cash. Mission accomplished. Now, all we need to do is leg it. Get back to the car and get out of here. You can only exit while you are in the main objectives that are complete. The levels end when all the accomplices have escaped. Make sure you've got everything you came for. We don't have much time, so you'll want to run. Right click near the card to select here to choose run. That will help speed things up. Great. Okay. Like exit, let's go. Run. Okay. Run. Here we go. Look at him. 18 seconds. 18 seconds. Escape. Escape. You a hole. You are not running now. Get in the car. There we go. Seven seconds to spare. There we go. We, we missed this and we missed that. Pick carefully. It's not wise to leave expensive toys outside. Oh, interesting. Well, there we go. There, that's, that's you know, that's the, the premise of the game, I guess, right? That's the whole heist simulator. It's actually really cool. It's pretty cool. And the fact that you can make your own levels is even cooler. I love that. What is this? Create interactions. Learn to create interactive objects in create mode and add achievements to a level. That's really cool. 
and this is Shaka Spears' birthplace. Find the famous poet's hidden vase. Huh. Yeah, anyways, I think this is gonna be it for, for this. I know it's very short, right? I apologize for it being very short. I've been doing a lot of Let's Look Ads right now, but um, yeah, this is Let's Look at High Simulator. If you guys enjoy this, let me know down in the comment section below. Uh, maybe this is a game we add to our playlist when we when it fully is released. I don't wanna like spoil it too much. That's also another reason why I'm kind of holding back on it now, because I don't wanna spoil it too much because this game seems pretty cool. Anyways, thank you guys so much for hanging out with me, and I will see you in the next video, wherever that may be. Do as always, take care. This is for all of you, not just a song to listen to, something to give you hope to hang on to. I'll be in your pocket full of something.